Hello, so if you have a Toyota and you want to get some diagnostic software, I have my three top picks for you and you will find the best pick for every budget. This V pick is the best budget pick. You have best diagnostic software for computer and you have best diagnostic tool for smartphone. Well, the most important thing, how much will they cost? V pick adapter costs around $20. This one is for Android. If you need one for iPhone, it will cost maybe five or 10 bucks more. This is the mini VCI cable, which comes with its own software and it costs around 40 or $50. And this thing, the Act 2 costs 150 for the first year and then you have to pay $80 a year every year think the act and mini vci cable for the toyota they are very similar they basically have every function you will need so let's get into those devices first thing you can need is to scan fault codes from your car now every three of them can scan default codes from all control units not just the engine it's definitely a must for diagnostic tools like this but for this cheap vpic it is actually not very common that it can read codes from all control units vpic doesn't have its own app you will need to use use CarScanner ELM OBD2 app which is probably the best free OBD2 app that you can get and works for both iPhone and Android. If you need to read fault codes you can do it with all of them. The next thing that you need your diagnostic tool for is reading the live data from your car. Now the VPIC can read only the engine live data but it will also show you live data as graphs. ThinkDiac can read data from all control units, it can show graphs, it can display four graphs at once. Mini VCI cable does show live data from all control units but without graphs. Next we have the bidirectional function that your scanner is capable of commanding your car to turn on components for example engine cooling fan power windows basically everything that is powered by electricity in your car so you can easily see if it does work next service functions the vpic doesn't do any service functions service functions are functions to use when you're doing mechanical work for example resetting the oil interval unlocking your electronic brake calipers to change the brake pads adapting new components like new throttle body and stuff like that these are service functions, VPIC doesn't have any, but what you can do, VPIC does work with Carista app, which is paid app, you need to pay $10 for one month, but you can use it to do some service functions and customizations. ThinkDiac does have service functions, and also this mini VCI cable does have service functions. And last, ECU coding, which means customizing your vehicle settings. VPIC does have some options, not that much in the car scanner app, but again, if you want to customize your car, all you need to do is to buy Carista app for one month. You can do all your customizations, unlimited customizations in one month, and then just cancel the subscription. Your customizations will stay. Think the app can do customization, and most settings to customize are in this mini VCI. Which one is the best? Well, this is best for low budget. I mean, this mini VCI is also, I guess, low budget. It costs $50. It is probably the best pick. If you need scan tool for Toyota, and Lexus and you have laptop which you can use the mini VCI cable is just the best pick and this thing the act is best for those that need to use the diagnostic scanner on other vehicles because this has very wide vehicle coverage this does cover more than 10,000 different car models you can use VPIC on every car also and this mini VCI is just for Toyota and Lexus